Mm, to si má Ghost of Tsushima. Urlo, čkara. Urlo, čkara. No, ale si mňa nie. Urlo. You know, that's, that's a really good game. Uh, it should have won game of the year, but unlucky, I guess. Shit, yeah. 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 Unlucky. Yeah. Well, Check it out. Play Ghost of Tsushima. We're not sponsored by Ghost of Tsushima, if anyone was wondering, just saying. We, he could sponsor us. So we'd love to, honestly. But if yeah, you're not sponsor us. There's a, li- a, a really good thing in the game. Like, when you pass dead, you, you just, like, tap... Uh, Something like you know the tap the the, the uh, where's my console? Oh, this one, you know. You see the tap here? You just like yeah. do this, yeah. do like this, and if if there is a dead bodies, he will go there and like he will say, name You know, pays respect for the dead. You know, that's wow. that's really good, man. That's what's the that's translation really of what you just said, by the way. That another day, another episode. Two fourteen, and this is the first episode we record after wow. New Year's. How about that? New Year's. How about that? Twenty twenty one. Twenty twenty one. And episode. we are joined today by uh, Saad and Sufyan. Saad, let the world know who you are and what you do. Habibi, uh, first of all, pleasure that you guys invited me. Um, uh, I'm I'm Saad. Saad and Sufyan. Uh, first of all, uh, thanks for uh, inviting me. It's my pleasure, actually. Welcome. Uh, for myself, I'm just a normal individual dude. I love playing games. Uh, I graduated from Japan. Um, I do uh, have some content in YouTube or Instagram, but I'm, but I'm, I had a break now. Uh, that's it so far. I'm just a, I'm just, I'm just a gamer, like a r- normal individual person, gamer. Yep. <laughs> Two hundred and twelve episodes for gamers to bring a gamer on the show. I'm very happy. Honestly, right? Yeah, <laughs> like it's, it's finally, yeah. Yeah, finally happens. I'm glad it's a, a gamer from our backyards, you know, from our parts of the world. Right. It's nice True. to see. But also, I mean, you you lived in Japan, which is kind of like the place where most of the most amazing games come from. Yep. Yeah. Blood, I recently played Bloodborne, which is a game straight out of like there, and it's one of the best games I've ever played. I don't know if you ever played that game. Uh, I'm not. I'm not a soul game actually. Oh, you're not a soul gamer. No. Like, what kind of gamer are you? Yeah. Uh, you can say I'm a competitive person. So <laughs> I play competitive game. Yeah. Right. Yeah. For example, League of Legends. Mainly <sighs> League of Legends, though I'm suck. In League of Legends. <laughs> I mean, yeah, welcome, welcome to the club, honestly. Uh, but I like right. the, uh, you know, stealth single, uh, single player games. Stealth single player. So Assassin's Creed. Um, yeah, maybe, yeah. Maybe. So excited. <laughs> so excited for Valhalla. Uh, you still didn't oh, play it? I did not. Yes. Oh, bro, it's the best game. Uh, that's that should have been game of the year. That should have yeah. been game of the year. I played oh, like a lot of games. Valhalla has been my favorite game this last year. And this year probably is still going to be my favorite game because that game, I mean, it's just so good. You should play it. You should play it. Uh, I will. I will, inshallah. I will. I love actually the the Vikings uh, community, the Viking, the Vikings culture. I like it. I really like it. Because they're, you know, like, (laughs) I love the (laughs) Millers. You know, I, I really love this game. Yeah, uh, that game is exactly like that, by the way. Pretty it's much. exactly <laughs> like that. It's just that's fun. Literally, just walk, and kill. Go walk and kill. Go kill whatever. Yeah, literally, just run, walk, stealth, kill. In a manly no. way. Kill. Oh. Yeah. Or, oh, <laughs> like, oh, without the law. Or like the old and Akbar with yeah, them, right? It's, it's, yeah, right. Yeah. It's, but it's, 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 it's a good game. It's a good game. Yeah. Uh, controversy definitely has made its way into the gaming world for a while now. Uh, uh, the biggest controversy right now is winner of this, the one game that won seven awards for the 2020 Games Award, right? Last mm-hmm. of Us, which uh, or the Last of Us Part Two actually it won the following yeah. Game of the Year, Best Game Direction, Best Narrative, Best mm-hmm. uh, what else is there? Best Audio Design. Uh, 
what else did it win? It won like a bunch here. I mean, that's a bunch. Of, I mean, you know, it's a very well made game, you gotta say, but it is controversial. Like, some people really loved it, and some people really hated it. And remember the games that you not some, I think a lot of people like. Like it's it's man, it's split. It's very split, right? And like the games that usually win those are the ones that everyone loves. Like last year was God of War, wasn't it? Last year and, was yeah, I think it was. Right. And like that game, I remember playing that game. That was one of the most amazing games I've ever played. But God of so War dramatic, Okay. Story. Imagine putting yeah. imagine putting The Last of Us on the same level as God of War. I mean the first Last of Us, I would be like, That was okay. That was good. That was okay, really good. good. I remember we played right. it together. That was very good. It was a very <laughs> well done good. game. Yeah. Last of yeah. Us Part Two was just bad. It was terrible. I mean, you I don't have, know have you played it? Have you Bro, played it? Bro, no, but I watched walkthroughs because I'm not, <laughs> I'm not tem- like, no, yeah. walkthroughs is the same. I don't want to buy it, right? But yeah, you used to watch streamers. Dude, you, watch streamers play, you play watch it. Stream- that's how you decide when, how to play a game. You like watch people play it. Yeah, like, kind of, yeah. pretty it. much. Yeah, I, this is what I do. I watch people playing the first like 20 minutes of the game. And if I liked it and I want to see more, I'm not going to watch the streamer keep playing it. No, I'm going to go play it, play the first 20 minutes and see where it leads on to. That's how I Sometimes they do the same. Yeah, sometimes yeah. they do this. Like, I, I, I like that, I, that ruins the game for me, I feel like. But the I first mean, 20 minutes of a game that's like 6 to 20 hours, bro. Yeah. There's a lot of different yeah. games that- for example, like Ghost of Tsushima, I believe yeah. I believe it's 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 supposed to have the game. Of- yeah, game of the year should have been to either Valhalla or Ghost of Tsushima. Yeah, you yeah, know yeah. what's nominated, Ali? You, you uh, I can see what's nominated here. Ghost yeah. of Tsushima, one of them, one of the nominated. Yes. Here are the nominations for game of the year. We had Doom Eternal, really good game, very yeah. well done. Yeah. Final Fantasy uh, VII remake. Seven. Wow. I yeah, that, that that that's, that's uh, beautiful. That's I've been watching for a long time with my one of my friends. That's it's a really good game. Hades, I didn't play it, but I watched my friends live stream it on Discord playing it, and it's mm-hmm. such a it's a it's an amazing game. I love the concept. Ghost of Tsushima, beautiful. Animal Crossing, what? <laughs> I mean, it's one of the most played games this year. I'm sure, man. It's yeah, really yeah. Right? By probably like no offense, but probably by women. Let's be honest, <laughs> man. Everyone was playing. I know a lot of people. Everyone had a switch. Who plays, Bro, who has my a switch, sister man. hasn't touched yeah. a gaming console in 15 right. years, I would say mm-hmm. maybe five to 10 years, right? Until Animal Co- Crossing came along. Are you saying because women are not gamers? That's I'm not saying not women are not gamers. Yeah, I'm just saying my right. sister, who happens to be my sister, a woman, did it. How about play. Animal Crossing is the game that most non gamers play? How about that? Like Candy Crush. Fair. <laughs> yeah. Fair. Yeah. Right? Uh, yeah. And then you have The Last yeah. of Us Part 2. Now, here's what I'm wondering. How did The Last of Us Part 2 beat Ghost of Tsushima? Doom. Mm-hmm. Hades. What? H- Hidden Agenda. <laughs> yep. That's, 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 season, man. that's, that's pretty much, yeah. That's, that's uh, they're mean. actually promoting this game. Actually, it's because of the thoughts. Dude, uh, let's be honest. Remember, we uh, Ali, we made an episode with the, the Oscars being bullshit because they force tokenization. Right. It's the same thing. This is, yeah. It's the it's same thing, same right? Thing. They have a gay yeah. or homosexual, you know, mm-hmm. main character, and then they have mm-hmm. forced diversities, and then they have like forced, and it's just, it just feels forced. It feels too right. forced, right? Game, and it's games like this where I wonder whatever happened to games just being games and not politically correct or anything like that. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Like games was our escape from the political world we live in today. And now that whole politics is going into games and it's being, it's beginning to be annoying. So All right. like, I let me ask you. Uh, yeah, yeah, go ahead. Go ahead. Go for it. No, go ahead. No problem. Sorry, I don't think. I don't think. Yeah, I don't think there was. <laughs> I don't think there was any problem with games having coming from different people and like whatever. That's fine. Last of Us was a fun game, That's and fine, like, but... I love like Asian games are like amazing, right? Or Dude. games from all over the world, are really fun. Asians invented like, Mario. Political. Japan, <laughs> right? It was never Japan, political, right? and Mario was like the best game of all time, probably. Like, there's not a single gamer who hasn't grown up on Super Mario World or Mario Kart 
or yeah. anything to do with Mario, Yoshi's World. Like, not I a mean, if, if you really want to see a good rate of games, like we, we if, if I want to give my opinion about a real, a really good game, I'll go to, like, for example, Metacritic. It's a website for rating games, right? You guys know, know about it. I think so you'll, uh, yeah. you will find a lot of people that uh, voted, uh, I mean, uh, rate this game, rate the game of the year as a really bad rate. For example, mm -hmm. The Last of Us Part Two. Like the company said that this game is good. This game is awesome. But when we go to Metacritic, we will find a lot of people rate this game and played this game. They were talking about this game is not good. It's not the game of the year. This it, game it is, really isn't. had a really bad story, had a really, you know, bullshit crap going and going around there. It's true. I'm not, I'm not, I'm not, I'm not actually, I'm, I'm ex yeah, I'm actually, I got no problem. I got no problem with, 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 with <laughs> yeah, I, got, I got no problem with the thoughts of the whole world. We got no problem. We got, we actually respect You guys, culture, we, we got no problem. You, you don't need yeah. to force it inside, you know, our communities or our head. Our yeah, I'm, I'm, yeah, I'm actually, I'm not accepting this as, as like, for example, I'm, 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 I waited for like seven years to play the part two. Like, dude, I was playing this game when the first year in my university, when I was freshman year. Dude, this game was cool. But then, dude, they, they, they just killed Joel and a really... Crucial way, in, <laughs> like cheap way. Spoilers, spoilers, spoilers alert! By the way, yeah. <laughs> ah, sorry, if you, spoilers. If, if you <laughs> haven't realized by now, this episode is going to be a deep gaming yeah. episode where we talk about different aspects of gaming. Yeah. Spoiler warning from right now. You click off right now if you don't want any spoilers. <laughs> sorry. Yeah. Right? right. So um, don't watch. Unfortunately, I feel like. Go ahead. I feel like. Um, Even if they take a very long time making a game, it doesn't mean that it's going to come out good. Like, they took so much time with Last of Us Part Two. Everyone was waiting for it. I feel like that was part of the problem, that everyone wanted it to be amazing. And just like the first one, it was a complete, it was a different game. It is. Right? And now, another game that's like everyone's been waiting for and turned out to be a flop. 2077. Cyberpunk. Game, right? Cyberpunk, <laughs> yeah. Like Cyberpunk. It's good. It. It's not that now, it's bad. It's just that the game... Story, story wise, narrative wise, is amazing. It's really good. They just have a bad luck as a company. They have like eight consoles they're working for, like PlayStation 4, five, uh, and, five and uh, no, but you know, PlayStation 4, and also the PlayStation uh, Pro, 4 Pro, uh, Xbox, Xbox, uh, Xbox S. One, Xbox Series. Yeah, also the console. Actually, we got no problem with the game and the console, but the company had a really bad luck in the launching. That's just like a bad step for them. Just no, it's not bad step, bad time for them. That's it. They've been through in a lot. Yeah, but have. I'm pretty much sure that they will. They will get back. Hon honestly, fun. though, I th I think the way uh, 2077 could have been executed right was if they released it beginning of COVID, like March, April, May. Because everyone was stuck at home, people would have had the time to appreciate the game. And um, they had eight years up to then. Like, what were they doing in eight years? I don't get it. Like, how how did they take this long? It takes a long time, man, to make a good game. Oh, I don't, I don't know. Blame. Yeah, it's well, like, what about Among Us? Among Us is such a cool game. Right. I'm glad Among, Among Us. Among Us is the game of the year. Yeah. In my opinion. It, won, <laughs> it, won, it won Best Multiplayer Awards. Let's play it sometime. Bro, we'll definitely do that. Bro, I definitely bro. will. That'd be fun. Among 100%. Us is such a good, like, I love Among, Among Us. Among Us. Mm -hmm. It's um, a good game. Among Us was very fun. Yeah. Fall Guys, I don't know if you played Fall Guys at all. That had, like, a big peak. And then, and it, then flopped. it dropped. Yeah, it just yeah. flopped, like, right in two weeks after everyone played that game, and everyone's just like... The hype was in for it. Yeah. That just shows you how fast, like, a game can become the number one game in the world. And then no one plays it. Funnily it's, enough, it's just Fall... impossible to win in this yeah. game. That's why people dropped it. You know, you know what's funny? <laughs> uh, best multiplayer nomination: Animal Crossing, Call of Duty Warzone, <laughs> Valorant, and Fall Guys. Valorant, yeah. Valorant. Valorant was a good game. I like Valorant. By Riot. <laughs> By Riot, yeah. By Riot. It's it's Riot Games. For those who don't know, you probably do know if you're still watching this episode. Uh, League of Legends, that's their biggest title right now, followed by Valorant, and then they have Wild Rift on uh, phone. Did you play Wild Rift by the way? 
I do. I did. I mean, yes. You did? We. I still do with my friends. Whenever me and my friends go out and we're sitting at a restaurant and the food takes forever, we just pop up Wild Rift and we play a game while the food yeah. comes. So good. Dude, dude, dude. Food will never take forever in Kuwait. <laughs> I believe not you. in Kuwait. True. But we're not in Kuwait. We're, I'm in Jordan right now, by the way. Best oh, internet mashallah. in the Middle East. I study here. <laughs> Mashallah, yeah. Allah. So, uh, <laughs> Ali, Ali also. No, Ali's. Uh, I'm in, I'm in he's Beirut. Right yeah. Beirut. Yeah. 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 But yeah, like I remember, bro, Among Us came at the right time. It came mid COVID, right? Everyone was stuck right. at home. It was impossible not to find 10 people to play this game with at the mm-hmm. time, right? Now, Among Us is just dead. Like, dead? Yeah, none of my friends play it oh. anymore. I you know like why? A lot of people still playing it. Because, because the game depends a lot on the player more than the game itself, right? You need to know how to lie. You need to know how to do shit, you know? like I, I actually have never used the, the, the text box. I always yeah. play it with, with your friends, what... right? And it's funner. And you all mute as soon as the game starts. And you're only allowed yeah, to talk yeah. when the emergency meeting or a report has been done. Yeah. Now you can't find it. Like, you might be able to. But for me, someone who's an average gamer, I can't find 10 people to play it anymore. And if I do, it's going to be a short game. Why? Because I know everyone's lie and tell. No one can hold a poker face anymore. Unlike before <laughs> where it's like, oh, I'm so suspicious, but I don't know what to do. Right. And it, it was funner then. It was funner. It was a good game. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. Here's a game that I feel like is slowly dying off, but is just milking it now. World of Warcraft. <laughs> Say it. Why do, you think it's, why do you think it's dying off? Ali? I'll tell you. I played World of Warcraft for seven, eight, eight years. Eight years now. I've been playing that game. It's a good game. It's still relevant, right? Kind of relevant. Yeah. It's but it's like for ever. someone like me. Listen, my friends are into it for the PVE or the PvP. I like the story more. And the story oh, there, wow. like, imagine, yeah, imagine from 2004 to 2021. That's like 19, 18, 18 years, roughly 18, 17 years, bro. It's like, they're milking the story now. It's just, the storyline is good, but it's like, come on, this has to end, right? So what game, Why? Dad, do you think has the longest storyline that just won't end? Uh, wow! <laughs> oh, you think so too? <laughs> yeah, I played. I played Battle of Azeroth. Oh, I'm sorry. I'm so yeah, sorry. I, I played that expansion with one of my friends. I'm so, so he sorry. He told me. He talked me to. He taught me to play this game. And he was trying to convince me to play this game. I was like, dude, خلاص, يلا, you're my neighbor. I'm. I'm down for it. Let's go. Let's let's play the game. Listen, I'm so the sorry game. I about to play that expansion. shit expansion. That was such a bad expansion. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Crash. Okay. The last raid was really good. I have to say, the last raid was amazing. But everything. I'm not. I'm World. not actually into into uh, World of Warcraft. It's just you know, like you just tried it. I just tried it, and I just like play for the sake of my friend. That's it. Oh, uh, and how on yeah. your honest opinion of World of Warcraft? Let's hear it. Uh, <laughs> My poor, honest opinion about war, yeah. World of Warcraft. I'm gonna regret asking this question. Go ahead. It's, it, it's a good game, but it's not. It's not for you. Game. I yeah, see. That's, fair. that's a fair statement. Yeah, no. It's, it's a good game. Actually, it, they make, they making a lot of money per year. I mean, Better. subscription. You like you gotta pay that shit all the time, and it's like very expensive right. for like six months but no it's it's great i like i like all the work also like, also it's a solid game from the early thousands the, oh man it's we, a solid game. it is a solid game like they had the most concurrent players in wrath of the lich king which was 25 million people playing oh my god what? at the same oh time god. bro do you know how crazy that is 25 million people playing like, that's, that's a population of a really big country such yeah as big my, country it is yeah. It is. It's crazy. I remember back, like back in Wrath. I never played Wrath of the Lich King, unfortunately. But my cousins used to not log out because as soon as they log out, they have to be back in a waiting queue yeah. with thousands, like hundreds of thousands of people in front of them. <laughs> they have to wait hours just to get in the game. That's how intense that game was at the time, right? There was even a study where uh, World of Warcraft is more addicting than cocaine. 
it was a real study. It was a real study. Here, I'll pull it up here. Ali, do you think it's true? Bro, definitely. <laughs> definitely. Then why do you play it? Because <laughs> it's a good game. I'm not addicted to it. I'm not addicted. Wow, you say it's more addicting than cocaine. <laughs> it used to be. cocaine every single day. <laughs> because it's back like... when the content was great, 2008, wow, more addictive. It's only get more. It's only gonna get more addicting, not less addictive. Than crack. Games. <laughs> it's sorry. It's as addictive. Uh, hold on. I agree. Here, let me pull up the post real quick so people can see. I'll read it out loud. So, World of Warcraft is as addictive as cocaine. Report. Right. That's so crazy. The Youth Care Foundation, uh, Stifelson. I'm not even gonna attempt to pronounce that which works uh, uh, to advocate active alternatives to gaming, described the game as the cocaine of computer games world. Wow. The foundation's report is as yet to be published and is based on experience of gamers. Bro, you know in China, someone died from playing World of Warcraft for like three days straight? I've heard of that. Literally. I'm sure it's happened. I mean, yeah. yeah. Dude, <laughs> pandemic really studies happened. came That's from crazy. World of Warcraft. That's crazy. Mm-hmm. You you want me to tell you the story of how they like okay so <laughs> hunters in World of Warcraft used to be able to do a move called dismiss pet right dismiss pet dismiss yeah pet. You, uh, yeah you, mm-hmm. you played hunter I uh, yeah I believe I was a mark, marksman you were a marksman hunter okay well back then marksmen were allowed to have pets they still got yes. the buff and everything. Yes. Dismiss pet, you can do it mid-fight. There are some moves you can't do while in combat, right? Mm-hmm. They did in Zogorub, I think. I forgot which dungeon it was, but there's a dungeon where the boss puts a, a, something called a spreading DOT, damage over time, a dot, right? If that dot spreads to another player, it's increased. The damage it does increases. So what people did was they send their hunters, they get that dot, they just dis- they dismiss the pet. They go, they went to Orgrimmar, which is a major city in World of Warcraft. They resummoned that pet. The dot was still on the pet. And it just spread like wildfire because Orgrimmar is very compact with like a lot of people. Everyone kept dying. They had to shut down the servers. They literally like. Social distancing came from World of Warcraft because I remember like people were told not to go into Orgrimmar and to keep a safe distance between each people. Oh, wow. So it doesn't, mm-hmm. like the dot doesn't spread because the dot has an AOE effect, right? Area of down, of effect? Yeah. Area of effect. Yeah. yeah. So you have to stay out of that everyone's area of effect just so it doesn't spread. Like that's how crazy it was. Social distancing in game. Social distancing there came from World of Warcraft. <laughs> Imagine. Like, that didn't come from crazy. World of Warcraft. But it was also in World of Warcraft. Yeah, I mean, <laughs> yeah. yeah, but we did it way before, you know, Corona or even swine flu. This was 2008. Swine flu yeah, came out. Yeah, did first. <laughs> did yeah. they social distance, though? Did they really? Sure they did. Oh, whatever. Yeah. Do you there, remember yeah. that that uh, that dungeon, one of the bosses, he used to say, stay for dinner. <laughs> oh, man. <laughs> Wait, where, 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 which one was that? Wait, let me, let me try and find it real quick. I don't know, but it's like a, a meme between me and my yeah, friend yeah. who played this. Game. Yes. Oh, Raw the Gluttonous. Yeah, 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 yeah. That was in uh, BFA. That was the Wayward, Way, Wayward, Wayward Mansion. Yes, yes. Wayward Mansion. Yes, yes. I. I I'm sorry, Ali. You were saying something. Sorry, I interrupted. Yeah. You. Go ahead. Uh, I was just gonna say that there are uh, a bunch of people who die from gaming just for different reasons. It, true. One of the people, as you say, people say like play too much and they forget to eat. <laughs> they go in the hospital. One, two, it's like Pokemon Go, where people are literally walking around, <laughs> like and they get hit by a car <laughs> and they fall off the cliff. <laughs> it is oh crazy. It yeah. is Pokemon Go. I feel I heard is the most played game ever. Right? Let me see. That. Let, me, let me check that real quick. Yeah, because so many, so many people are still playing. It's such a huge fan base. That's what I love about some games is that like it brought people together. I remember a lot of people used to, used to go hang out and go search for the Pokemons. They used to go 
like collect the Pokemon and stuff. And it was a fun game and people still do that. Yeah, but Pokemon Go failed in Arabia very fast because it came out in the summer and no one was going to walk outside in the heat. Oh, is that true? Yeah, that's very true. I used to walk with my friends uh, in, in, in my university. Also, we used to walk, uh, drive through my neighborhood. We used to drive I too. <laughs> we used <laughs> to drive yeah. Pokemon. Yeah. Drive and catch Pokemon. Uh, according to Guinness World Records, Pokemon Go revenue was the highest ever of any mobile game played in its first month. Mobile game. Mobile game. Yeah. Oh. Sorry, Ali. While well, still comes up on top. But uh, here's, here's the topic I want to discuss with you. Do you think gaming causes violence, in your opinion? I'm just going to say it flat and straight because uh, there's no way to introduce this kind of topic. Because you have a lot of these presidents and world leaders saying, you know, all these shootings and all these different violence acts are happening because of gaming. And I don't seem to find any correlation. From my opinion, yeah, actually, um, it depends on the people. If you are less than 18, don't play the game. If you don't have any parents, to guide you to stay with you don't play the game i don't know but i'm not the i do i do say this but actually when i was a little kid no one cares actually my my parents did not care about what i do uh what, what i what i what i played in the past they don't know they're just like it's just a console let him play he'll shut up <laughs> that's it but in the meantime no there's a lot of things if i uh i'm a married person alhamdulillah i married him and December, uh, no, uh, thanks. Uh, no, no, uh, I mean, two months ago. Uh, two months ago. Uh, uh, wait, I'm not good with, with months. Uh, 11, 11, 11, November, 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 November. November yeah, sorry, sorry, two yeah. months ago, two months, two months ago. ago. Hey, thanks, thanks. So, if I gamer gets married, thanks. <laughs> Well done. Hey. <laughs> so if, uh, if I uh, uh, if I if I do have kids, I I will I will stay with them. I will guide them in games, and uh, I will will literally be their eyes on games. For example, like my my nephews, my nephews, they play games, but my sister don't don't buy them the game that fits to them. It's like the game that they play, it's rated under 18. And, you know, in our community, sometimes it's okay to, to do so. But abroad, it's not, it's not okay. Yeah, to do. It's really not okay to, like, buy a game for a child and the game yeah. is plus 18 or rated R. Or... But Call yes. of Duty, you mean? Right? Like, every, every kid plays any, any, Call of Duty. I, I, I know, I know. Any game, any game actually uh, promoting violence, like uh, Call of Duty. We're men. We grow up. I mean, we're we're grown up. We got no problem to play this game. We're not gonna be violent. Yeah, we're not gonna be, you know, aggressive. Yeah. But but when a fifteen-year-old is growing up on killing and shooting and see, that's the problem. It's it's not from gaming. It's this game is not pr promoting violence. It's not encourage people to do so. Mm -hmm. So it's actually it's it's your choice. This is this is an art. You know the sound of the, the sound of the of the guns, the sound of uh, the artilleries, the sound of the vehicles. Even the, the physics within the game is an art. Also, the physics in the game, actually, this is a really good art. It's really, I don't, I don't know, man. It's really, it's really not good if you waste this good art, uh, in the name of you know this game, encourage people to be no, violent. This, this yeah. is this is it's it's. I'm glad you said that. People. I will, I will say this though. Let me add yeah. this to the mix. It does bring out a violent side in every person, especially people who don't know how to control their anger. صحة. And uh, people who are very easily triggered. Put your hands up if you've ever raged at a game. <laughs> Put your hands up if you ever threw a controller or like flung something around because you lost. Not, not really. But okay. Put your hands up if you ever smacked your desk from how like unlucky you were or how unfair a game was. Yeah. There you go. <laughs> See? Violent tendencies. Yeah. 
Right. Now, here's where psychologically shit starts to go down the road, right? Or shit starts to hit the fan, actually. People take these violent tendencies way too long. They forget that in the end of the day, what's in front of them is just a game. So they bring it on to the real world. Doesn't have to be shoot up a school, doesn't have to be blow up a mosque, but it can be something as simple as being annoyed all the time. Someone says something wrong to you, you don't take it with an open heart, that person gets punched in the face. Why? Because you're still mad that someone ruined your KDA in Call of Duty back at home at 4 a.m. Right. You know what I mean? Like it's it's a series of events where people start to lose control. Mm-hmm. Right? Just like gaming addiction. And it's competitive. It's very and, competitive. yeah, people, yeah. let's not forget there are people who are very competitive, not competitive. Like there's a difference between competitive and actually good at the game and competitive and absolute ass cancer at the game. Just so right. bad at the game. Or like have right? a healthy competition or like unhealthy, like just getting angry. Exactly. Because of losing. Yeah. And people t- seem to forget to close that gap between it's just a game. Doesn't have to be reflected on real life. Right. So I, want, I wonder, Sad, how do you do it? Because I've, I've heard from a bunch of my friends that League of Legends specifically, we all played it. And then a lot of my friends don't play it anymore just because they got and toxic is what they always say. Like it's, I always get so angry after playing the game. Rainbow League. Six Siege and League of I'll Legends are the most toxic <laughs> communities in all of gaming. All right. How do you yeah. play it? Not <laughs> get angry. Actually, I'm a toxic person. When I lose, I'm <laughs> so he's the cause of that issue. He's not the <laughs> exactly. solution. When I lose, actually, sometimes I go like, "You play yeah, don't you? yeah, I'm flaming sometimes when I lose. But if I win, <laughs> I, I'll be like, "Yo, easy, 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 easy." easy it's easy, like this. Easy. Yeah. Uh, I'm, I'm, I'm actually a toxic person because. Um. My friends are so. <laughs> yeah. You gotta be. You gotta be with your environment. You can't be nice when your friends are toxic. Yeah, yeah, you it's like, up, so you gotta be toxic too. See, I once did did something like um, I you, used to play rank. Oh, so that's before that's before before I like when we are in the queue in the game like when in champion select, I go to the you know the chat bar. I type like, hey guys, I'm not gonna, I'm gonna mute all of you because I don't want to be toxic with any one of you. I'll do, I'll do my best in the game and that's it. Uh, some of them actually quit the game <laughs> before we start. And some of them are actually cool. Then uh, actually some of them said, don't, don't mute the pings because we're gonna ping you. You know, th- there's, uh, there's pings in, in the game. Like, yeah. Question mark, question mark, question mark, question, question mark. Question. <laughs> so it's, I don't, I don't, I don't actually right. mute the pings. I, I just leave it. But if it's annoying, I just, you know, mute it. I'm just going to mute it and I'm going to concentrate about how I'm going to win this shit. Mm. Otherwise, no. Like when I play normal, like Rift, normal Rift. Yeah. Summoner's, Summoner's Rift. Rift. Yeah. Normal. Yeah. Or, or uh, ARAM. I go like no problem, easy, 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 easy. Yeah, you just you just destroy them with easy. It's so funny. Yeah, I love that. I do the Allison, guilty as well. I do this all the time. I spam easy in the chat whenever mm-hmm. I win. Yeah, is it toxic? Maybe, but is it so bad? No, it's not no, my no, fault. No. You guys can't play for shit. I'm just good at the game, right? That's that's my thought. Is it right? <laughs> no, it's not right. You shouldn't think like that. But it is what it is. It's the gaming community. That's why... I uh, ethically, it. ethically, it's not right. Ethic, eth- eth- ethically, it's not. It's <laughs> really not right. Right. Ma, ma, ma fi you have oh, no, bro. There's no, there's no sportsmanship in gaming industry. It's like you're either good... <laughs> yeah. Sorry. Right? Yeah. No, don't worry well, about it's, it. It's interesting how it's like... It's a sport now, right? It's like... It is a sport. sport. Yeah. It, it is an e-sport. e-sport. It gets more people go watch... The Fortnite championships than any whatever soccer yeah, then the, whatever. Bro, it's then crazy. the Super Bowl. <laughs> then the Super Bowl. Right. Is that true? I don't mm-hmm. know. Really? Let me find it for you. This is <laughs> I wonder because I saw that event and it was just wild. Like how many people showed up to watch Fortnite awards or I mean league awards also, right? It's like do you is it is it gonna be an Olympic sport? Sad, do you know this? Or which league? one? Which one? League of league. Legend going to be Olympic store? A, a score? I mean, uh, yeah, sport? Olympic sport. Olympic sport. Well, I don't know. I'm asking you. 
I don't know actually. I'm, I did check, not dig check, up. Check check this out, right? Check this out. Uh, League of Legends esports giant draws in more viewers than the Super Bowl, and it's expected to get even bigger. Yeah. Wow. What timeline are we on? <laughs> What timeline are we on, bro? The gaming universe is winning, honestly. It is. <laughs> it yeah. is. And it's it's crazy. Now here's where I think it's like I'm I, I'm conflicted about the whole situation. I don't know if I think it's good or bad because I don't want gaming to be the moral of life where people try to, you know, go into it to secure a job. But at the same time, I'm all for people doing what they love as jobs, right? And I love to see people, you know, growing and expanding, just like Sad. Sad is great at what he does, right? He's a gamer too. And this is his job. Why? Because he loves it. But there are people who go into gaming, they want it to be their job, not because they love it, because they think they'll reach a point where they start making big money. And that's a dangerous job to have, right? Mm -hmm. So, well, it's up. It's up to them. It, it, like, listen, in the gaming industry, even if you do something special, or else you're gonna lose your money, lose your time, and lose everything. Like any rest, any like the rest of the games. Like yep. you know, like it's, for example, do you, do you remember the anthem? Oh, anthem. oh I remember Last anthem. Yeah, 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 yeah. It was it was really good in the in the release, the first two days, and or maybe the first one day. And then everything is crashed. Nobody remembers this game right now. Yeah. Also, yeah. they paid a lot of money on it. They, yeah, they did. So, so they, they really did a great job in the game, but eventually, no. Because I believe, I believe, they just want money. They, they just want some money. Yeah. So it's, they really love the game. They the, will, concept, they will. the concept of the game was brilliant, though, with Anthem. I got no problem with anyone try to make money out of game. I will yeah. be more than happy to watch yeah. you guys compete each other. No problem. This is the battlefield. Show me <laughs> your 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 skills. Come on, show me. I'm a gamer. I would like to see a really good game. I'm I'm ready exactly. to pay. I'm ready to pay fifty dollar per per month for like one two game. No problem. I got no problem. hundred dollars. No problem. This is been my doing. salary. <laughs> yeah. This is this is my money. This is I I, I earned this money. I'm working. Yeah. I was also right. like you guys work right. But I'm not going to pay anything. I'm not going to pay a penny if this game is not good. And by the way, I'm not going to buy this game unless if I see some people will playing the game, rate, playing the game or rate the game. Because, you know, not, 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 not any game are going to, you know, yeah. just buy the game and that's it. It's true. So this is the battlefield. Show me your, your skills. Show me your abilities. But I think that's how the gaming industry grew, by the way, because back then... <laughs> I am PlayStation 3 and like Xbox, you know, one 360. No, yeah, PlayStation 3, Xbox 360. Yeah, 360. Uh, there wasn't a lot of people uploading full gameplays on YouTube or anywhere else. Twitch wasn't even a thing at the time, right? It was mm -hmm. still new. So a lot of our games was trial and error. We'd buy the game, we'd save up, buy the game. Seven out of ten of the time of the games we buy is trash. Only three games are actually really good and we play. Yes, 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 yes. Right? I remember there was like a catalog, you know. Mm. <laughs> yeah, I you you this. open it, yo shit. By Sab, how much this guy? <laughs> how much this one? <laughs> oh, ten real. Yeah, okay, no problem. Yeah. I'll take it. That's yeah. yeah. That was my, my games method. used to be That's cheap so... too, by the way. Yeah, games used like to... ten real. How how much uh, how much is in in dollar? I don't uh, know. Ten real here. I'll search it for you. How about it's that? less than three dollars, maybe. But also, you didn't have to download ten gigabytes of the game after you buy it on CD, <laughs> yes. right? Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> right. That's like I get. <coughs> oh my god, that's like half KD. Yeah, yeah, less dinar, even. Hey, which is like mm. what five bucks? No, no, five no, bucks. less than less than two dollars, like, man. Like two dollars, bro. Wow. Yeah. yeah. I mean, for real games, yeah. Games, I mean, yeah, they they, they, were, they, they were they were they were cracked. Uh, no, uh, they were like uh, uh, how can you say that? Stemmen? Cracked. 
نعم مكركة ليجل اه كراك يا ليجل كراك يا ليجل اوبن يا اوبن اوبن ذا كاتالوج اند ذن جست لايك واتش هاو ماتش از ذس 10 ريال هاو ماتش از 10 ريال اولسو 10 نيكست يير 15 ذا ذا ورث ات ناو اتس لايك ناو ذا ريد ديد ريدمشن 2 I bought, I bought, I bought Shadow of the Colossus. Ten real, all wow. ten real, ten wow. real, dude. Yeah. It's, beautiful game. It's, beautiful. If I, oh my God, Shadow of the Colossus, two thousand six. No, game. you can't. Um, the PlayStation Two. That was a cool game. That was good. Those are different days. Ten real, yeah. ten real. Well, that's maybe why they don't want you to like buy on CDs anymore. They want you to download it straight. You know, the PS5 doesn't have a CD port. Some of them, you can buy them without the CD port, yeah. right? But it doesn't mean you can't crack it. Let's not forget, gamers are always going to be on top of games themselves, right? <laughs> it's literally, I can go into the PS5's files, copy it, put on a USB, give it to you. You have the game. I don't know, man. I feel like they have ways of, to, I feel like PS5 is very, they know people are going to do that. Do oh no, honestly. Have you played the PS5 yet, Sad? Did you no, get it? No, no, actually, I did not. Unlucky, no. unlucky. I'm no, getting no, it like no. next week. Hola, <laughs> Ali Shimmery, getting a PS5, man. Next week, nice. I'm getting it, boys, and I can't wait to get it. It's so, like I'm, I'm oh genuinely God. excited. Dude, Ali, you're Shimmery, right? You, yeah. You are. You're like um, my clan is Shimmery as well, bro. No way. Hola, cheers, Habibi. El cousin. <laughs> My cousin. Let's go. <laughs> But yeah, no, it's, it's crazy. Listen, the gaming industry, like we're almost out of time here, by the way, just saying. But the uh, gaming industry is going big and bigger and way big. Like it's just growing like crazy, right? And future games are looking more and more promising with each year that goes by. So sad. future games people should look out for or should consider playing as soon as it drops. What do you think? Which games? Mm. Last of Us Part 3. <laughs> I'm not going to play that game. <laughs> <laughs> if it's going to be exist. <laughs> if, if, no, they'll probably milk it. Watch. What game should we try? Tsushima mm. like, mm. Kurodo. Tsushima mm. Kurodo. You know, that's that's a really good game. Uh, I should have won game of the year, but unlucky, I guess. Shit, yeah. 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 Unlucky. Yeah. Well, Check it out. Play Ghost of Tsushima. We're not sponsored by Ghost of Tsushima, if anyone was wondering, just saying. We, you could sponsor us. So we'd love to, honestly. But if yeah, you're not a sponsor us. There's a, little, a, a really good thing in the game. Like, when you pass dead, you, you just, like, tap... Uh, Something like you know the tap the the, the uh, where's my console? Oh, this one, you know. You see the tap here? You just like yeah. do this, yeah. do like this, and if if there is a dead bodies, he will go there and like he will say, "Yasurakani nemure," you know, pays respect for the dead. You know, that's wow. that's really good, man. That's what's the that's translation really of what you just said, by the way? Yasurakani nemure, which is mean rest in peace. Rest in peace. Or, yeah, wow. something like this. That's crazy. Now, if it was me, I would have been like, Haha, bitch, I just move on. <laughs> <laughs> It's a game! Why do you have to respect to a dead, dead zeros and one? Like, those morals, man. Those are important. <laughs> That's for if I if I if I if I gonna do the same game, but in an an Arabian concept or Muslim concept, we will do the <laughs> maid, you know, the dead salah, you know, yeah. <laughs> you know. I will, I will, I will bury them, bro. <laughs> respect for the dead. Yeah. Well, I'll be respect for the dead, bro. Yeah, I just put their heads on spike and ride on my horse, like. So, oh my you know, that's what I do in Valhalla. That's actually what I do. Exactly, toxic. I, 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 I literally show you now. This is this is what I do. But I, I basically, I kill them all, right? I grab the biggest body, put him on the back of my horse, and I just ride. Where am I going? I don't know. But this is my trophy. And I just killed it, right? Now, here's where it becomes shit. Sometimes you walk into like a distrust area where everybody kind of hates you. You're walking in with their people's body on the back of your horse. Still killed them all. Thank you for watching another episode. Oh, oh my God, Ali. No. no, don't do it. That, don't say that out of context. That's horrible. 
<laughs> I, killed them all. I, I did it some no, trip, though. I killed them all. No, be peaceful. Make games that are loving, like unrespectful, like Ghost of Tsushima. Or Animal Crossing. <laughs> Animal Crossing. <laughs> Thank you for watching another episode. Uh, if you did enjoy this episode or you agree with some of our shit, hey, what are you doing? Like, subscribe, do it now. Like, right now, right now. Uh, subscribe. Uh, Sad, do you have anything you want to shout out or love the world know? Love you guys all. What? <laughs> <laughs> Amazing. Another episode. Uh, go ahead and follow Sad on all the socials. We'll leave a link to that in the description below. I'm, been, I'm Eddie. That's Eddie. Mario Sad. Is, I'm and uh, peace. Around 12 midday, which is usually like the hottest point of the day. So I just yeah, see you. So then, it, then it was out just warming up. It's not, you know, trying to do anything. It's it's just making sure because uh, snakes are cold blooded. So they cannot generate their own body heat like we can. I see. So they they are uh, they are required to you know be in an area where it's warmer so that way their body can function because they can't generate their own heat internal. I see. But what what I also realized on that day was back then I won't lie snakes were my biggest fears until when I realized that they would I faced my biggest fear right yeah Live in the action not even in a controlled environment right just in nature. <laughs>